loves, what's up going, what's good, what's popping, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be showing you how I achieved these spring twists. So if that's something that you're interested in seeing, keep watching. The hair that I'll be using today is from Unbound Hair Store and they're on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description. So it came with six packs of hair. Yes, six packs. I'm wondering if I will be needing to use so much, but this is what the hair looks like. This is just one bundle of hairs. So it's definitely a lot. And as you can see, it has this ombre effect, which is really nice. It is darker at the roots and as it goes down, it gets lighter. And these are the remaining packs. It also came with some free bonus items like this these are two small clips and it is good for sectioning but because it is so small you can only section off small sections the other thing that came in this package is a small hair tie but it stretches a lot and there are three other hair accessories that are decorative so let's just get into the styling i will be first and foremost moisturizing my hair and I'll be keeping this hair cell in for, for two or more weeks. So I've been loving this hair milk by Aunt Jackie's and it softens my hair. So I'm going to just spray that in so my hair will be easier to style as it will be softer. I washed and detangled my hair yesterday so I shouldn't have much trouble detangling. So now that my hair is softened, I'm going to moisturize it with the Quench Moisture Intensive Leave-In Conditioner. I love this and it's helps me to detangle my hair quickly while moisturizing it. Okay, so because my hair was previously detangled, I'm going to go in large sections and just go back over. So I don't have much problem when parting. However, if you're just detangling your hair for the first time, you might want to do it in smaller sections. So now that my hair is fully detangled and moisturized, I'm going to start doing my partings. But I'll be using a rat tail comb. I'm going to go off camera and use a mirror so that I can see what I'm doing with my parting and I'll be back. Okay guys, I ended up doing most of my hair off camera because it was difficult doing the back. I would need a mirror so I did that off camera but I will show you how I install it at the front. So let me show you what I have right now. So this is what the back looks like. And I'm going to show you from the front how to achieve this spring twist. So let me just get the back cut up. So far I used three packs of hair and this will be my fourth pack. So for each section, this will be one section, I use one strand of spring twist. And I'm not going to fluff it or anything, I'm just going to leave it as is. So I add some Eco Styler Gel to the section. Then I use my detangling brush to just comb it out. Okay, and I basically give my hair some definition 
because of the type of hair that I'm going to use because it's curly hair I want to get my hair curly as well so that it will blend better so I'm going to divide my natural hair in half then I bring the middle of the spring twist as close to my scalp as possible basically on my scalp then I twist my hair with the spring twist just once and I put the next side underneath tighten it and then start twisting and it's as easy as that so as soon as I twist the section with my hair like when I reach the end of my natural hair I just jump to the end of the spring twist and start twisting so I twist to the the honey blonde I think that's the color to so, so the honey blonde section and then I basically just use my finger and wrap both wrap both of them together to get a bit of curly ends yeah and that's what it's looking like so I'm going to show you guys again so I part a section this can be divided in three okay and I'm going to use that little clip that came in the package and put this out of the way okay so I add gel from roots to ends I use my detangling brush to comb through so that I can get some definition now that my hair is curly it will blend better with the spring twists so I get the spring twist I don't fluff it so I'm going to be using it as is I divide my natural hair in half bring the spring twist as close to my scalp as possible twist my hair and the spring twist together once bring the next side underneath twist that once then start twisting as normal so it's fairly simple so I'm going to twist until I cannot feel my natural hair any longer so my natural hair stops about right here so I'm going to bring my fingers down to the end of the spring twist and start twisting So when I get to the honey blonde part, I'm going to just twist them together by wrapping it around my finger and it will naturally just fall into each other.
is what my hair is looking like after I'm all done. And it is really light. I ended up using only three and a half packs. So I have two and a half packs left. And I think I could have used just three packs, but I was experimenting at first. So some strands of the hair were wasted. So I can get to use the remaining two and a half packs another time and get two styles out of it. Okay, I think I prefer it in a side part. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to purchase this hair, it will be in the description down below. In my next video, I will be sharing with you different ways to style these spring twists. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure that you're subscribed and that you turn on your notification bell so that you'll be notified when that video goes up thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye guys